My name's Andy. I uh, own Yorkshire Fence and Deck. Um, I studied in England six years ago. Had the opportunity to emigrate to Vancouver, and here we are. And I brought my expertise and trying to rewrite the wheel in BC with all our fencing. Yeah, we do prefab cedar fencing, uh, hand built, customized to most customers' preferences. Composite, vinyl, and soon to be aluminum. Basically, uh, Christmas last year, I decided to try to tap in and find a product that protected the posts. Customers were always asking, can we do extra concrete? Can we do extra of this? Extra? So let's just kill that and get to the bottom. And that's where I found Al at Fence Armour and it's been great ever since. 99% of customers are going with it. It's protecting from above ground and now below ground with the post saver. And it's been, it's been fantastic and customers are spreading. And now I'm getting educated by them when I go to estimates. They're asking all oh, these these post protectors, these post protectors. So the news is spreading. So Andy, what what made you want to find a solution for that? I wanted to be different and I wanted to be above everybody else. And when we build things, we do it once and once only. This product adds to that philosophy. So <clears throat> were people complaining about problems with the bottoms of the posts? Oh yeah, yeah. Constantly, especially on stratas like this, constantly chip-ins from you know weed whackers people who don't really care they just weed whack to town also rot that's one of the main issues in BC similar to England it's a rainforest it's all soft mush rain 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 we got ants carpenter ants are a big issue as well so this helps protect so it's a double double whammy perfect and the wood, what, what type of wood do you use? We use um, mainly cedar, western red cedar, old growth and new growth, and pressure treated. They're the, they're the three, well the two, two mains for what we do. I mean this is new growth cedar, so this is anything up to 60 years old. It's more of a, of a yellow shade than a western. That's right. the old growth, and we can show you that on other sites. Beautiful, so then when you're quoting fence armor now, what type of customer are you looking for? To be honest, there's no target. Everybody's accepting it. From the entry level who just wants to, to fix it and sell, all the way to the top. So does it does it differentiate you from the other guys? Yes, because nobody is even interested in installing extras. They just want to turn up, do the fence, walk away. What would you say is the biggest problem in fencing in BC? No post protection. Wow. No post protection. There's wood fences <coughs> everywhere, no post protection. The so, fence only falls over when the posts give. Yeah. And that's the issue. That's the issue. So you use it, the double, you try to sell both the fence armor and the post saver? Yeah, we do. We aim to do both because we're protected above and below. Right. Below, I cannot control, so I'd rather just protect it and it's done. And above ground, we see it and it's, it's good. We personally prefer the six inch pro series because we've got extra on top. Perfect. So you put half in, or about yeah. two inches in the yeah, ground? Yeah, we, we go four inches above, because yeah. the rules are different for out here, we have different grounds. So we go four inches above, two inches in the concrete, and we put a nice chamfered bevel, okay. then everything underneath is protected.